My name is Johanna Hauska, and I am a final year BFA student at Portland State University. I focus primarily on textile and garment design, and my work is involving sustainable and responsible systems from soil to garments, and including slow craft, biodegradable materials, material innovations, technology, natural dyeing, and ethical and responsible sourcing methods. I've combined all of these by designing textiles as well as garments that together uh, combine a bunch of different systems from modern innovations and technologies to historically slow craft methods. I'm a hand weaver as well as using um, computerized looms. That's just an example of utilizing both historical and modern methods to create a more holistic view on sustainable garments, textile, and fashion in general. My BFA thesis collection that I'm showing is a collection of six looks made up of multiple garments around an alternative historical thought of the second industrial revolution of the 1910s and 20s. I'm heavily inspired by silhouettes and design systems of that time, but I'm curious in creating a collection of original designs inspired by that time period with a modern outlook on responsible systems, especially with agriculture and really creating a story with every look and every garment. I truly believe that the better the story in making a garment, the more sustainable it happens to be. Cultivating fibers, cultivating plant dyes, and incorporating that into the final product. Um, a lot of my works are ones that I designed with a 3D program. So again, using modern technology to my benefit while also maintaining my love for slow craft of hand weaving, knitting, sewn construction, and incorporating modern material innovations. Really taking all these different aspects of what I truly believe is sustainability and responsibility in garment industry and viewing it holistically and utilizing as much as I can from different areas and different perspectives to create a collection that um, incorporates all of these different methods of creating either slowly, historically, and through modern technologies.